Hello and welcome back to another Dan BTF Geo Guesser video. Uh, today I'm revisiting a map. Um, I've done this a few times. I've obviously revisited football stadiums and the country streak mode, etc., etc. But um, this is the first time I've revisited a finding that particular place video. So we've done obviously KFC, um, McDonald's, and now we've got to find that weather spoons. Um, part two coming up so hopefully I don't get um, the same ones coming up again as you can see I did get a high score of 25,000 points but it took me 16 minutes and 23 seconds we can just have a quick look refresh ourselves on the five weather spoons that were sort of gifted to me that day we had um, Letchworth uh, there was one down in uh, Wales in a place called Abatilli. It's actually this this map is this map is harder than you'd think. Um, we had Hatfield, one out here in Lowestoft, and there was one more which was up in Bryhouse. So yeah, sixteen minutes was when I when I look at that, that's actually not that bad considering all of those places. I, I still haven't really heard of them, so um, apart from Lowestoft. <laughs> Apologies if you're from any of those other places. Um, let's get on with it. Um, we'll go default settings um, and see what we can do. So we've got the star next to an HSBC. Um, hopefully along this high street, we'll get, um, you know, sometimes you get a charity shop or something that says the name of the town on it uh, it's quite I mean it's not helped by the weather here but it's a little bit dreary what does that say just specy spec savers <laughs> opticians um, let's keep going if this is your high street obviously let me know um, No, no one's mentioned. I say sometimes cancer research or one of the, the charities mind scope. What's this? Poundland. Are you going to tell me where we are? Looks like we might be heading out towards the sea. Pep and Co. Man City. Oh, we're in Gosport. Um... That right there is the Spinnaker Tower, which is in Gunworth Keys in Portsmouth. Um, but I can tell just by the way the tower is um, pointing that we must be over there. You can see that the star, I mean, the star was standing out there like from miles away. So um, <clears throat> assuming, yeah, let's go. Let's just go back. We've got Labrooks. Yeah, so we, we're actually more outside the HSBC. Um, I'd love to hang around on Gosport High Street, but, you know, we got, we want to beat that high score. Now, is this a, a London one? I actually know exactly where this is. Obviously, you've got this here. This is Fulham Broadway, <clears throat> um, home of Chelsea Football Club, Stamford Bridge is just up here around the corner. Um, there's a food hall in here, but let's. Um, this is a nice easy one for me I'm just familiar with the area um, and this will help to uh, potentially get a nice score so we're we're there we're outside just on the end of Metro Bank uh, don't want to go hmm I don't want to get this wrong well no it's not going to be wrong but I don't want to get um, a low I don't want to drop any points there we go 5,000 next we have the Duke of Wellington where the spoons now are we going to get Stallbridge probably is possibly the place I don't know um, but let's do the same again we'll just have a look. So we've got Park Street. 
Um, Costa, right. Have we got any... Uh, oh, Seafront. Dunster, Bridgewater, and Taunton. Now, Taunton is Devon, I think. Um, so we'll just see if we can find that. Could be could be wrong. Taunton. Taunton, Taunton, Taunton. Can I say it anymore? Um Taunton. Right, anyway. Torquay. Maybe it's not. Right, let's uh let's go down to wait, 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 wait. This place looks lovely, by the way. Um, Minehead. There we go. There's a Butlins in Minehead. Um, Minehead and the Duke of Wellington. Minehead looks really nice. I'm impressed. Um, so, coming... Oh, the road goes north. Uh, yeah, so we must be just on this corner. Outside the HSBC. Uh, there. Boom. 5,000 points. That's uh, that's three done. Now we're outside carpet right. We've got a coral. We've got a flat roof weather spoons. Flat roof pubs, obviously, very... Um, very uh, synonymous in the UK. It's called the Five Quarter... Um, which is 1.25, isn't it, really? Um, Parish Church, St. Cuthbert. <clears throat> I think this is a flat roof pub, maybe with a car park on top. Yeah, it is. Um, so, Asda sometimes tells us where they are. Castle Dean. Now, I know that. But I don't at the same time. Castle Dean, Shotton and Easington. Is Castle Dean Dean Community College? Forest of Dean is spelt differently, isn't it? Right, we need a decent junction. Castle Dean, that's that's uh let's go up here. Yeah, so we got the C out to the um, <clears throat> to the east here. Yeah, this might help. Um, tell us where we are, Durham. Right. So maybe I didn't know where I was. Uh are we in it? We might even just be in. For some reason, Newcastle did come to mind, but. Let's have a look if Durham has a Castle Dean shopping centre. Doesn't necessarily look like what I would perceive to be Durham. Um. Okay, let's keep going. We might get a, sh a road sign in a second. Oh, that ta that was a town. Right, Horden. And this has got to be on the coast. Because... Durham Heritage Coast. Hartlepool. Hawthorne. Seaham. Castle Eden. Hendon. Am I barking on the wrong tree here? Right. Uh, Hartlepool to the right and Eastington to the left. That helps. So we are in the right area. 
Hartley Ball. And then it's a case of what was this place called? Horden. And that road that they're on is the A one oh eight six. Okay. And what am I looking for? Horden, Horden, Horden there. <laughs> Hold on, what you're doing? Uh, Castle Dean is here, and right, we will find our five quarters. It's got to be round here somewhere. Right, let's go back. So I didn't actually, I don't think I did know what Castle Dean was. Um, so Coral is to the south. Can we find Coral? Sports Direct. Job center. Um, and then we came out of Coral there. And then we're heading north to a roundabout. So roundabout. There we go. The five quarter. So we want to get our top marks on this. Um... There's a little car park in the middle there. We're on that road on the outside. I'm going to say... I would say that we're there just because we're up against carpet right there. <clears throat> and we're also, we're further... We're actually... I would say there. Boom, three yards. <clears throat> We're on to the final stretch, and we've got the Silk Mercer, Weatherspoon's free house. Um, looking at it here, I'm going to say potentially Edinburgh, although Silk could be more sort of like Bristol direction. Um, right, who knows where we are? The Bear Hotel. Come on, let's get this for a good score. Tell me where you are. Uh, sometimes, obviously, the buses will reveal. Borwood House near Chippenham. <clears throat> Chippenham. Old school cinema. Uh, all right, let's not. The Dolphin. Woodworth Brewer. All right, give me a sign. There we go. Through traffic. <laughs> this tells me nothing. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Oh, there we go. That's that was a a handy sign. All right, North Gate. Wow. Okay. Doesn't tell me anything. Um. Right. We went that way. No, we didn't. We went this way. Cool. <clears throat> These ones are frustrating because this is obviously somewhere very distinctive. But it's a case of actually can... We've got loads of pubs here as well. Right, what did this guy say on his thing? Uh, Thorn. No. Right, I think we go just out of town here. Right, we've got Swindon, Salisbury... So Swindon is to the east, Salisbury's to the south. So Swindon to the east, and as I said, Salisbury to the south. Does that put us in? Yep, Chippenham. And what are we looking for? 
<clears throat> in terms of the name of the thing. I think we would be in Chippenham. Chippenham would make sense. Um, can't remember the name of the uh, pub. The Silk Mercer. And it's on a road that goes north-south. Dominoes. Hmm. I don't know. I'm not convinced that that's where we want to be. Yeah, the bridge house. I don't think we're in Chippenham. Right, so if we're not in Chippenham, could we be in Bath? Would that be... That might be too... I don't think we're in Bath. Okay, right. This is definitely ruining our score. <laughs> but, hey, let's just enjoy it. Enjoy it while we're here. Um, maybe sub to the channel. Think about subbing to the channel. While, while I'm looking around, you can get on with that. And I'll meet you back here in a minute when I've worked out exactly where I am. So... Somewhere in Wiltshire. What's that say? Sometimes these, um, I've lost that. It was going so well, guys. It was going so well. And then. Okay, so that says, book your next event. So have I missed a really obvious, have I missed a really obvious sign? I think Wardworth is a place. It would be in this area. Tidworth. Um, Avonbury, Chippenham. I'm still not convinced that we're, we're definitely not in <laughs> Chippenham. Uh... But Dominoes The Bath Arms What's that saying? Diseases. Wharf Center. Lots of talks of. So we've got. Um, <sighs> so Marlborough. I always get. I don't know this part of the country at all. I always get lost here. Marlborough. A. Um, four. <clears throat> M4. M4. 
Andover. So these are to the east. Andover, Marlborough. And Salisbury. There. And Trowbridge. And Chippenham are there. Oh, it is... That is the name of the place. <laughs> I, all right. How do you pronounce that, for starters? And have you ever heard or been to... Devies? Devises? Divi... I don't know. Uh, so, yeah, this is where it's going to be. Um, Moonraker, Southgate Inn. Uh, M&S. It's called the Silk something, wasn't it? Um, right. Let's go back. It's got a castle, apparently. We were on... Again, like I said, a road that goes directly north-south. Struggling to find the street name. Even having found this place, well, for what I think I, I've I've found, uh, I'm struggling to find. So this is a, the center. We've got a Pizza Express and the Bear Hotel, and this is called the Marketplace. the marketplace there <clears throat> the bear so it must be along here the silk mercer we got there eventually it was traumatic it was uh, an unenjoyable finish for me um, I'm not going to lie. What was our total time? We came in at 20 minutes and 59 seconds. Now that's five minutes slower than my previous uh, perfect score. And you can see um, that we had up to five minutes to get that last one. And uh, we didn't get there in the end but i actually do you know what i really like this map i think um if you'd like to see a part three and um i'd quite like to do a part three um please let me know because it says there's over um i think 500 yeah 500 plus um locations on this map so there's like you know i've done 10 so far so there's 490 out there i can definitely afford to do a part three and the likelihood of one of those that i've already had popping up is quite slim um but yeah if you enjoyed the video sorry i took uh 10 minutes there on the last one um but yeah if you enjoyed the video please do give it a thumbs up below um sub to the channel and make sure you have that notification bell turned on um and until then uh, I'll see you on the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.